First here at 530, making Colorado's highways safer and preventing crashes that shut them down. Now take a look. You might remember this from the snowstorm last week. Semi trucks off the highway, others involved in crashes and many more stuck in the snow. A bill that just passed the state Senate wants to prevent this from happening. It focuses on semis and other commercial vehicles and is designed to make them stop speeding and be prepared for winter weather. That by requiring that they carry chains in many parts of the state. Plus, it creates no passing zones where crashes are common. This includes Floyd Hill, the Eisenhower Tunnels, Bale Pass, and Glenwood Canyon. It also increases fines for speeding in that canyon for commercial vehicles. Plus, it pushes CDOT to study where more chain stations could be built. Every hour that I-70 is closed costs our state $2 million in economic uh, spending. And so it is uh, a common sense way to increase safety, but also help our state's economy and prevent these closures. Now, the original bill was much more strict than the one that passed today. However, some truck drivers still have concerns about how the new rules could affect them. I reached out to the Colorado Motor Vehicle Carrier Association and have not heard back yet. The bill, by the way, now goes to the House.